while I'm here feeling so much love and appreciation for this area, um, I wanted to do a video on the three things I love most about the southern zone of Costa Rica. So I would say like the southern zone of Costa Rica is from Dominical downwards and maybe a little bit upwards too on the South Pacific side. So like Dominical, Uvita, Hochal, get further down, you get into the Osa Peninsula and all these places. So number one, empty beaches. So it is New Year's Eve right now. It is the 31st. Um, high season has definitely come. Uh, there was lots of people around but I don't see anybody here, do I? That's why I just love this zone. So that's actually the whale's tail right down here. If you've looked into the area at all, you might know what the whale's tail is, the Marino Baena National Park. This is part of the national park all here, which is why you'll just see nothing. There's a whole lot of nothing. No buildings, no establishments. And there is a nice, I can actually access this beach from my home, which is why I also love it so much. If you do come, I can tell you where the beach is. Just shoot me a message and I can let you know where to find this one. Um, you, of course, just wanna take your normal precautions coming to the beach if you're gonna be here alone with valuables, normal stuff. So yes, beaches. Uh, it's literally New Year's Eve. The town is packed. I mean, there's a lot of people, but nobody here. Nobody. Anybody? Anyone? Nope, nobody. Okay, reason number two. I almost forgot what it was. <laughs> the community. So the reason why I love this southern zone, which I'm sure you can also find in other parts of Costa Rica, for me personally, is the community here. I think it's a great community of Teak Costa Ricans. I think it's a great community of um, other expats who live here. I feel like it's uh, like we all know each other. We all take care of each other. So that's a pretty big deal. I think it's a wonderful community of people. Um, of course, there are exceptions, but just like anywhere in the world. But overall, wow big on my list for why I choose here and okay and the last one the last one um I love this place in Costa Rica because you can feel like you're very away from it all it's not as commercialized but then you still are close to what you need so if you need to go to the doctor or there are hospitals bigger grocery stores so you can still get to what you need or drive to go get it, um, but you still can feel very away from it all, which I love. That's what I love about, especially my neighborhood too. I feel like I'm really away from it all, but then I'm five minutes away from everything I need, which is amazing. So yeah, those are my reasons why I love the South Pacific of Costa Rica, why I've chosen to live here, and I think why a lot of other people do too. And as usual, if you need any other information on Costa Rica, if you wanna look into my services, check out the links in my description below. I help people with their information for planning for their trip, planning for their move. And then on a bigger scale, I help people who want to move to another country. It doesn't have to be here. It can be, yeah, so someone who's ready to make an online income a way that they like that fits well for them and that's gonna like uphold their budget while they wanna be abroad. And all the transition stuff, all the logistics. It feels pretty overwhelming if you're thinking about moving to another country, but you take it piece by piece and yeah. So feel free to check out those below.